TMZ, front and center right now. Why are you letting Gypsy Rose and April play games with you? I'm going to show you guys what TMZ posted, and I'm going to tell you the backstory because this is about to blow your wig cat back. So TMZ posted this article today saying Gypsy Rose Blanchard FaceTime a young boy with rare illness, sweet side, and checked. Y'all, so <laughs> this is a little boy that his mom has been pandering to TikTok. And Miss Ma'am, I said what I said. Come on my page and come for me. It doesn't matter because you're doing exactly what Gypsy and Dee Dee did. Okay. So, Gypsy's been FaceTiming this little boy with a rare disease, and Gypsy's friends have been saying that he's terminally ill. His mother has said he's not, but she is using this to get money, and Gypsy is using it to basically look like she's a better person, even though she's a monster. Now, if you look here, you can see that this little boy is in the hospital, so yes, he is sick, okay? And that's why she's using Gypsy and Gypsy's using her. Now, this mom, instead of taking care of her son, she's trolling the internet and getting upset at creators that's speaking on this. Last night, his mom was on Morbid's live. And she was in the comments section saying, take my son's picture down. And I didn't give my picture to anyone. And Morbid said, okay, you know what? I just need you to send me a timestamp from when the picture's on there till the time that it ends on the live and I will take it down. Just email me. She emails him and proceeds to troll him an email. She didn't send a timestamp. She was just talking smack. She wanted attention is what she wanted. Now, she was also on another lady's live. She's not a creator. The lady just goes live just because she's gypsy Stan. And on this live, she says she doesn't know how TMZ got the pictures of her son. This is clearly her son at the hospital. So she has the internet believing that TMZ basically stole her son's pictures, which is making TMZ look quite the clown. And trying to say that, well, they just got these pictures and they made this article and she doesn't know where they came from. And she said this on live today. Y'all, when I say anybody Gypsy Rose puts her hands on, looks a mess. This is a prime example. And this lady's running amok on the internet instead of worrying about what she got going on at home. Playing games with Gypsy Rose. You know, you play stupid games, what happens? Chell, TMZ, I need y'all to read the room. Because you know Gypsy posted about her memoir. Which, why should she have one? Nobody should be reading about somebody that unalived their mom for sausage. It just doesn't make sense. But in her comment section, they were eating her up, baby. Let's look at it. So this is Gypsy's page, and they're talking about Gypsy Rose Blanchard. She goes, it's surreal that my memoir, my time to stand is out. Her time to stand, as if she was in a wheelchair all her life. We know she was walking because that muscle was strong enough to walk out of Nicholas Godichon's house. That muscle was strong enough for her to stand up in that interrogation and scream she wanted a lawyer. So the muscles were working, so she'd been standing. Gypsy, you been standing. So it shouldn't be your time to stand. It should be, it's my time to continue lying. How about that? Just a little over three months. If you'd like to pre-order a copy, you can get 25% off at Barnes & Nobles. First of all, tag Barnes & Nobles, front and center, because y'all should not be having this in your bookstore at all, whatsoever. Whether you're making a dollar or not, this is ridiculous. Now I'm telling you, they ate her up in the comments section. So let's look at the comments, chow. Someone said, yeah, no. Someone else said, social you know what we can't say this out here you got enough money girl no way someone else said i'll buy it someone else said never gonna buy yeah that's a no for me nope no thank you then someone else says i don't like her in other words someone else says nope never gonna buy it i'll pass somebody else says we love you gypsy tmz this is why you should be reading the room them comments tell you out of what, 10 to 12 comments, only two were positive? So what, 20% or less? Y'all got to read the room. TMZ, why don't you do an article on the autopsy? How horrific the aut autopsy was. How about you do that? How about you tell us all about that autopsy? That would be nice. You know, some of the many discrepancies in there. Actually, how about you tell us all about the fact that they said in a police report they received a call at 357, but somehow 
the medical examiner's report said that she was pronounced unalive at 314. How about you talk about the discrepancies where the state dropped the ball, but also the Gypsy Rose is a monster. How about, how about you do that, TMZ? Because I respect you guys a lot. But this right here, y'all got to do better. I'm calling y'all out because this is not appropriate at all. And I stand 10 toes down on that. And Miss April, whatever you got to say, it doesn't matter to me, baby. Because I know what you're doing on the internet. I have watched it firsthand. And one thing I don't like is people using their kids to make a dollar so people can feel sympathy for you. You need to do better. I said what I said. And if you don't like it, you know how to exit out. Bye-bye for now.